we're only using the Perseverance rover at a fraction of its real potential. First of all, the fact that we can't joystick it in real time because it takes anywhere from 5 to 20 minutes for radio signals to get from Earth to Mars, and it's got to go both ways. Plus, we have to operate it so conservatively because you don't want it to get stuck in the sand. There's nobody to pull it out. Wouldn't it be great if we had astronauts on Mars? The rovers can still operate as autonomously as they're capable of doing, but if they ever run into a problem, you can joystick them in real time. If someone wants to send a better experiment, rather than waiting 10 years for a new rover, you take out an old experiment, you put in a new one, that's what we did with the Hubble Space Telescope, because every time we visited, we would take out old instruments and put in new ones, which were more powerful. Someplace like Mars, we really could take advantage of humans and robots working together.